favors outpacing and outnumbering their prey over individual maneuverability. Calculations suggest creatures up to 100 times the bite this body weight could succumb to a focus assault by a pack of 10. Avoid packs, try not to bleed. Got it. Definitely got it. Okay, uh, I am slightly worried about uh, my th power slowly going down. Um, scanner room fragments. That might come in handy. Integrating new PDA data. Okay, um. Passing 100 meters. Oxygen efficiency decreased. Oh, that's not good. Okay, so the deeper I go, the worse it is for me. God, it. What the hell is that? 30 seconds. Bioreactor fragments. Um, okay, uh, can I. Thank you. Uh, I'm not comfortable going near 100 meters. I have way too little oxygen for that. Okay. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Um, anything? Over here. Uh, power, bioreactor. On planets where organic matter is plentiful, but sunlight is not, a reliable bioreactor will frequently prove the most efficient power solution. Maybe installed in any multi-purpose habitat room. Chemically composed organic materials converting them into energy over time accepts all plant matter from seeds and spores to moldy fruit and vegetable it can also process animal matter and some organic waste products energy production is proportionate to the calories in the organic matter the bioreactor totally organic oh good to know good to have that um scanner room this advanced habitat module can transform a small outpost into a burgeoning science and exploration station. A 3D display in the center of the room stores local topographical data. Systems can, yeah. System can scan for and pinpoint particular materials. Ooh, that might be useful for finding stuff. A remotely controlled drones scan an area up to 500 meters in range. Nice. Wall mounted cameras feed. Uh, feeds allow for live control of scouting drones. Upgrade console may be used to enhance the module's functions. Okay, but that, that re requires me... Like, okay, Seamoth requires two more pieces. Um, yeah, that requires me to build a base, but... Uh, habitat build, I need battery, computer chip, wiring kit... That's a lot of materials. Uh, I think that also included gold. Not entirely sure. Um, in the, oh hi. Ooh, wreckage piece. Okay. One hundred meters. Oxygen efficiency decreased. Yeah, well aware. Okay. I can make the bioreactor. Good. Another scanner room fragment. Although I think I already have this. No, I need one more fragment. Um, okay, can I cut open to act? That's what it. 30 seconds. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay, that's what I need the uh, the laser cutter for, but I need to find more fragments of that. Okay. I'm getting way too distracted by stuff over here. Oh my god. That sea glide really launched me out of the air. Okay, so I can't go into here just yet, but I can at least scan the environment for anything useful like that. Another scanner room piece, thank you. Okay, and I'll stay above 100 meters to preserve oxygen. Um, okay, any... I... A little biter. Uh, anything else of use over here? Um... Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, there's three of them. Oh, four. Um. Yeah, um. I don't think these things are actually attacking me. Okay, self scan. Advised. Self -scan oh, bloody hell. Vital signs normal. Detecting trace amounts of foreign bacteria. Continuing to monitor. That is not good. No. Okay, oh boy. Um, 
What the hell are you? You have an entire ecosystem. Gold papyrus? Oh, that's a plant. Okay, furled papyrus. Okay, functions of the distinctive curled leaves on this aquatic plant is not immediately clear. It is possible the leaves unfurl in low light conditions or that they are designed to channel water currents through the main body of the plant, thus enhancing nutrient wake up. You're a reef back. With a reef on your back. Okay, I can see where the name comes from. Oh my god. Reef bag Leviathan. Okay. The size sounds quite probable. Um, Leviathans. Reef bag Leviathan. This is a fast life form. It's in excess of 30 meters long and has been designed Leviathan class or designated as Levi Leviathan class. Fortunately, it feeds exclusively on plankton like life forms in the water. It's a big whale! A uh, chitinous shell. Most of the life forms topside and some of its underside is protected by a thick layered exoskeleton. This suggests an evolutionary path quite different from other organisms on 4546b, most of which are vertebrate in nature. The reefback species has likely been able to grow far larger than other herbivores because anything large enough to break through its shell has long since gone extinct. Enzyme pods. Similar in appearance to the algae glands of the gasopod, these organs on the reefback's underside serve some unknown purpose in its digestive system and are capable of, of expelling small quantities of stomach enzyme into the surrounding water. So don't go to the bottom of these reef bags, but otherwise they are friendly, I guess. A local microcosm. An array of different barnacles and plant species grow on the reef back shell, thrusting their roots into ancient scars in the chitin or chitin, and taking advantage of their mobility to avoid predation. Oh that's cool. Nonetheless, reefbacks will often be pursued by the faster, hungrier herbivores, and thus this leviathan species is a mobile microcosm worthy of years of study in itself. Oh, that's, that is really cool. Uh, life cycle. Reefbacks' lifespan likely extend through many centuries, should they survive their initial growth cycle. For the first few decades, their smallest size would make them vulnerable to carnivores carnivorous leviathans, searchable, seen traveling in small pods and communicating by an echoing call, behavior is consistent with low level sentience, harvest plants, small fish and metal rich barnacles. Oh those reef bags, they are cool. Okay I'm liking them, um, doesn't mean I have to worry about them I think? Okay, let's see if there's more stuff that we can scan. Better to scan it right now than later. More bioreactor, which means more stuff. Uh, Passing metal salvage. Oxygen efficiency decreased. Yeah, yeah, well aware, well aware. Okay, is there anything else of use here for me? Anything. Can I... Uh, I... Something over here? Laser cutter, yes, okay. 30 seconds. I'll take that. Okay, I need one more laser cutter fragment. Um, I hate the fact that I don't have enough oxygen all the time. I'm gonna have to fix that. But what did I need for the better? Only silver. I have glass. Uh, it's 100 meters deep. I can make that. I'm going to the stranded uh, near the, under attack. That might be worse for me, but okay. As long as I stay above the 100 meters, I'm okay. I think. So I hope. And they're dead too. I'm going to guess, unless they're still alive. Um. Ooh, another one of the sea moths. Okay. Um. I'll. I'll scan you. Making a sea moth could be very useful. I okay, need one more piece. Uh, abandoned PDA. Nothing Integrate else of PDA use. Data. Okay, let me go to the surface. Let's take a listen. Oh, that looks amazing. 
<laughs> oh, I love reef bags already. Thirty seconds. Okay. Um. Yeah. Let's see. Data bank. Um. Survivors. Lifepod seventeen crew log. Ozzy's log. It's the day of the crash. I don't know what the heck is happening. I'm scared, and I'm not going outside. There are shadows in the water under the hatch, but I can't tell if they're rocks or aliens. And there's weird-looking caves nearby. The Aurora was carrying everything needed to build the phase gate. Mobile vehicle bays, bioreactors, propulsion cannons. It had a cinema. There, there was a zero-G gym. My cafe. I don't understand how we're here now. I don't know why no one's coming for me. Oh, boy. Oh, that sucks. That really, really sucks. Okay, um... So, wait, we... We had a zero-G gym. <laughs> That's cool. And, of course, cinema. What are propulsion cannons? Could I, perhaps... Is there, among the wreckage, a propulsion cannon of some sort? Can I use that in any way to face against enemies that try to kill me? And is there anything here remaining? You had the, the Sea Moth piece. Um, is that... Gold! I got... Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, well aware. I got gold. Scanner room fragment. I'll take you. And, okay. Let's see. Anything else of use? Uh, by the looks of things, it doesn't look like that's the weird cave they were talking about. That's some salt. I'll take it. Um, 30 seconds. Yes, 30 seconds, got it. Uh, I think that's all. By the looks of things. Okay. Um, how much stuff do I have? Do I have enough? Or do I need to scavenge a little bit more? Um, oh, I'm near in the max. I have enough salt. I have a lot to tame. One silver. I might require more, but with this much titanium, I think I'm actually going to go back to my base. Get, at least get the extra oxygen. Keeps me going, allows me to go deeper for longer. Get more stuff. I can do this. It's just going to take a little bit of time. Oh my god, I love this sea glide. It's so freaking fast. Okay, um, radio. Hi. Aurora, this hi, is Hi, 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 hi. We just picked up a massive debris field at your location. Oh, so you noticed. I didn't know how bad, how many of you. Yeah. I, I didn't know. Now you know. We're now en route to your location. Okay. We're gonna bring you home. Sunbeam out. Thank god rescue is on this way. What else can I say? The only time... I parked a rig this big on a rock that small was in VR, and I blew it. It's a bad option, all right, but so are all the others. Dude, your radio was still on. Seek fluid intake. Yeah, thank you very much. I will consume Vital signs stabilized. some. A lot. Oh my god. Drinking way too much water. Um, I need food. Do I still have the... I have the nutrient block and a... Decomposing cooked peeper. Eh. Uh, it gives me food. Yeah, you're better off just throwing that back into the water. There's more than one peeper in the ocean, even though it means that this poor peeper died in vain. I think I might be better just throwing that out. Return it to the nature where it once came from. There you go, my friend. And I will take your other friend and his brother. Excuse me. I have fish to cook. I'm a terrible person. Definitely. But at least I have a nice meal. Absolutely perfect. Okay, so. Um, what do I require? Uh, I need glass two times. Uh, I got a lot of salt over here. Quartz over here. This is what I need. One, two, three, three, four. That should make two glass if I'm okay. If I'm right. Because I need two quartz, one glass. Yes. Okay, perfect. And beyond that, we require... I have to... 
Oh, I need to remove it. Um, can I do that with the current stuff that I have? I'm a hoarder. Absolute hoarder. Okay, let's see. Can I... Yes, unequip. Perfect. Okay, please upgrade. Thank you. Okay, so from 70 we go to... Or 75. 135. Oh, thank God. Oh, that's going to help me out so much. Um, rebreather. Conserves oxygen when diving deeper. Absorbs and recycles CO2 into breathable air. Biomesh wiring kit. Um, useful, but I think I'm at... Oh, I need... I need two lead... I need two lead for... Oh my god. Okay, that sucks. That absolutely sucks. Um, I'm gonna have to go back there, but at least I can. Uh, one of them back. I'm gonna make another waterproof locker. As lo I'm gonna need to make that habitat builder at some point, but as of right now, I don't really have a lot. Um, where is my... Yes, my locker. <laughs> it takes a moment for me to notice where it is. Okay, let's see. If you go right over there. Perfect. Um, I'll put the copper in here. Or, no, 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 no. Not what I'm going to do. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven. I'm going to make sure that I have enough water to last a really long time. So I don't have to worry about that for a while. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven. I'll be able to find salt again at some point, and as long as I don't need salt for anything else, I'm good with using bleach as my drinking supply. But still, really, everyone, don't drink bleach. It's it cleans the water. That's what it does. Oh my god, I I'm out of power. I I did not even. Oh boy. Um. Oh. Oh, thank God, it's going back up. Oh, for a moment I thought I had a limited amount of power and I didn't even realize I had power. Oh, thank... Okay, it's still empowered. <laughs> oh, that would have been a way to go. Oh, why did you die? Well, it kind of drained all the power from my life pot and I didn't take any precautions in that regard. Whoops. Oh, thank God I can still use this. Oh, boy. And I'm powered again. Okay, I'm going to leave the power for a bit, and in the meantime, I'm going to stuff this full with all this water that I now got. I have a lot of it. Uh, one more bleach, so I need to do a little bit more. Okay, here we go. You filled to the brim, nearly to the brim, with high-quality water. And I can always return to that in case I need more. Uh, I need a little bit more power, please. Just... Yes, thank you. There we go. That should be enough. That means you completely ready. Uh, no. There we go. Okay, so this is my water locker, in case I need more. Um, have enough of it right now. Have normal filtered water. Uh, no. E don't cut it. Don't cut it. No. Okay. Um... I have fiber mesh. I uh, okay. I'll dump the rest of the copper in there. Okay, I have more oxygen. I'm okay. In that direction, I was able to get stuff, all the lead and stuff. But there must be more of it in different directions, right? Ooh, uh, before I go anywhere, I am going to run out of battery space at some point. That's gonna happen. I need more batteries. I need to replace them at some point. Um, and of course I dumped all the copper in a different place. You need, thank you very much. Battery, battery, battery. Perfect. I'll make two of them just in case. That should keep me going. You're depowered again. And I will take, uh, is this the high quality water? Yes, it is. Okay, I'll take two of them with me. Um, that should be it, I believe. I'll leave you behind. Okay, so 
in that direction I was able to get lead and gold and silver. But no, that was in that direction. Use the Aurora as your point of observation and stuff. What if I go in this direction? I can't go close to the Aurora just yet because of radiation, I'm going to guess. So if I were to just swim in this direction, look out for those sandstone things. Maybe find some other stuff like sand sharks and more blueprint stuff. Craft trap fragments. Oh, okay. Oh, I only need two of you. Now I can already make you. Okay, interesting. Um, yes, uh, where exactly? Does it say anything? Uh, not really. Uh, craft trap. Deployable. Uses artificial gravity to attract light objects and small creatures? Ooh. Um. Okay. In interesting. Where's my life pot? Where's? There's my life pot. Okay. I'm. I'm gonna give you a different color. I want to always know where you are. That is a lot better. Okay. I'm actually gonna see if I can make one of those. One copper, one titanium, one battery. Equals one craft trap. Okay, so... Artificial gravity to pull objects towards you. Okay, so if I... Does that work on fish? If I were to place you over here, there you go, I can pick you up again. Oh, 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 and that makes it so much easier to grab you, buggers. <laughs> no escaping now anymore, friends. You can swim fast, but you can't escape my graft trap. And titanium. I'm gonna leave the creature egg alone. Oh, but that is cool. Okay, so if I were to leave you over here, do you drain power? Do you end up breaking down at some point, maybe? In any case, that is an easy way to get peepers. Oh, that's glorious. Okay, good, 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 good. That means... Um, time to continue our search in that area for more blueprints and also for quite possibly more lead and gold and silver while staying away from those freaking stalkers okay anything useful no those are locked could i open those up in any way no it doesn't show anything like i need a cutter of some sort um i don't think there's anything else i can scan are you just normal limestone yeah i I think I'm going to leave the limestone things for now. I'm also going to leave you three alone. More limestone. No. Freaking sand sharks. No thanks. Ooh, are you sandstone? Yes. Okay. Take that silver. I need it. Need lots more uh, limestone. Uh... These environments, they do look really awesome. Still, knowing that there are sand sharks hiding in the sand, yeah, no thanks. Meanwhile, I have another laser cutter fragment. Um, yes, that is enough. Okay, that means... Oh, hi, stalker. How are you doing? Stay there, in your biome. Thank you very much. Okay, what have we... Got with the laser cut. What do we need for that? Um, blueprint. I need diamonds? Where the hell am I going to get diamonds from? I have the cave sulfur, but... Oh, boy. Okay, that's gonna be more problematic. But... Yeah. Okay, this is stalker territory. Um, are these just quads? Yes, they are. Are. I don't need quartz as of right now. You're another salt deposit? Yes. Okay. Just 
Look for more sandstone, not limestone. Sandstone. We need the gold. Uh, I'll take a little bit of salt extra. Um, are you... Laser cutter. Don't need laser cutter. You. You are what I need. Sandstone. Lead. More lead. Okay, that means I can actually make my radiation suit. Perfect. Uh, sand shark. How about we don't bother with you? Um, anything else? It's limestone. Okay, the sandstone is going to be difficult to find. More lead. Um, coral shell. Wait, I've already found you. And the reef bag. Where are you? I hear you, but I don't see you. That Oh, you can hear them from so far away. That is glorious. Okay, it's getting darker again. Not entirely happy with that. What are you? Lithium. Special equipment is required to collect so many resources. Ooh. This place look, looks a bit more barren. Um, limestone, yeah. Okay, I need more sandstone. Where are you? There's more lithium. Oh, oh wow. Okay, um, I'm gonna go up and get a little bit of air. Okay, um... Is that? Okay, for a moment I thought this was a big skeleton of some sort. Looked like it! But... Not entirely sure... What it is. Um... Red words. Anything useful to me by any chance? Doesn't look like it. Uh, redwood, a common plant adaptable to many different environments. The redwood is a staple part of the diet of many smaller herbivores. Well, good for them. Very good for them. Oh my god, that goes deep. I can't go below 100 meters right now. Like, oxy uh, oxygen efficiency uh, decrease and stuff. Limestone, don't need that. Oh boy, that goes freaking deep. Oh my god. Okay, um... No sign of any sandstone at this point in time, though. Which kind of sucks. That's more limestone. I need more sandstone. Oh my god, that's a big freaking quad cluster. Oh. 30 seconds. Yeah, 30 seconds. Well aware. Thank you, Karen. Um... Oh boy. How far am I? 600... Six... Yeah, 666 meters. Cool. Okay, well, um... Still looking for sandstone. I'm not leaving until I find more of it that I can use. And as long as nothing tries to eat me, like those freaking sand sharks and stalkers, which aren't around here, by the way, which I'm perfectly fine with. Um, are you anything? No, not really. Um, spade fish. Hi. Can you get over here? Come on. Spade fish. Yes, where are you? Spade fish. <laughs> Again, some of these fish look so doofy. I like it. A medium-sized herbivore found in deeper waters. Single eye. Observe swimming. Diversity in this region is unusually low. Cause unknown. That is actually interesting. Why would biodiversity be so low? Hmm. Anyway, a uh, single eye. Observe swimming near to the seabed from where it can keep its one eye on predators in the water above it. Uh, mottled green coloration, commonly encountered in plant-rich environments. The spadefish is well adapted to hide amongst the vegetation. Spadefish tend to move in loose shoals and despite their low speed will take necessary measures to avoid confirmed predators. Edible. Oh boy. Um. <laughs> Night. Time. Sucks. Oh, but, oh, that, that looks amazing. Absolutely amazing. Oh, boy, so, yeah. Um, I have my lights. 
I'm beginning to get ever so slightly scared about this place. Just a bit. Seeing these spade fish swim in this area is rather confusing me because the data entry clearly states that these fish like to hide in vegetation. Did these just get lost or is something else going on? 